What's good, YouTube? I am Sad Boy Will, and today we have Heihachi Mishima versus Geese Howard, Tekken versus King of Fighters. Now, I know a lot about Heihachi. Um, I'm a decent fan of Tekken. Uh, don't know much about Geese Howard. I know um, uh, somewhat of what they told me earlier in the prelims. If you want to check that out, uh, 14 minutes of them going over the tail of tape. Um, that'll be in the, in the, in the description. So you can check that out before we jump into this battle. But, uh, I've never been big in the King of Fighters, Terry Bogard, any of those guys. Uh, but Tekken, Tekken was my, my jam. So I'm, I'm rooting for Hey Hachi. I feel like it's going to go because Hey Hachi has, as a, has a thing for throwing people off of stuff and geese, and his games were was thrown off a building twice, um, so I feel like Heihachi's got this. I I just feel like Heihachi's more durable. Like Geese obviously has has the more offensive power, but I think Heihachi is is more built like built defensively. More he could take more hits and deliver like great like even 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 heal even even power you know blows. I don't I don't know what I'm trying to say. But yeah, uh, I can see Heiachi winning this. So let's jump right in. Welcome to the final match of the international collaboration between the Iron Fist and King of Fighters. Of course, there's a volcano right there. It's already set up for Heiachi just, just to throw him in there. I wonder if Kuma Kuma gonna join in. They didn't really talk about Kuma's like beats. Come to die. What? Hmm. Yeah. Give him that god fist. I can't believe that Heiachi's like 75. But he is a grandfather too, so makes sense. You have to try more than that. Unpredictable. Oh, okay. Throwing mountains. Die forever. Like, Geese looks like he's winning, but Heihachi is taking all of this. This is nothing no different than what he gets from Jin and uh, Kazuru. His son and grandson. Predictable. Yep. Let's go, Heihachi. Alright. Getting closer to the volcano. Okay. It's funny because they fight with the same type of fighting style. Throw them all. That's not gonna. That's not gonna kill geese. Oh, that boy cheese. Damn. Really? That's it? Golly, that's gruesome. Hey, Hachi does not quit. Yes, sir. Hey, Hachi does not quit. Let's hear it. Break out the soy sauce for geese because this is cooked. 
I saw it a mile away. Tenacity and martial arts mastery to push each other to the limit. But Heihachi just had the greater limits to push. Yeah. Sorry, Wiz. This one was obvious. There's more durability. One of them people off cliffs. The other has people throw him off cliffs. See? Kind of a no duh. It was duh. Not, uh, no duh. In fact, Geese's wider variety of chi techniques were able to keep Heihachi at a distance. Yeah. And his ability to draw chi from the earth meant he could spam them for as long as he wanted. But Heihachi has had plenty of experience He's fought many with many of spammers like Kazuya, whose lasers are fast enough to reach outer space in seconds. He'd have no trouble getting in close. Heihachi's decades of combat training over Geese also allowed him to learn and adapt to his Aikijutsu. Shout out He's Heihachi, man. Aikido masters like Nina Williams Aikido. Before, so oh, she kind of bad. Ultimately, it came down to who was stronger, faster, and tougher. Both scaled to characters like Jack and Takuma, who survived satellite lasers nearly equal to each other. But both feats were performed pretty casually by weaker characters. So what could they do at their best? For Geese, let's look at his fight with Verse, who created that hurricane. What? Oh yeah, to I the remember him talking about this. Of the clouds, making a storm Who is that in, in the in the in the Komodo at the bottom right? Hey, booty cheeks all out. I think I know who that is. I just don't remember her names. Like I said, I'm not like super familiar with King of Fighters characters outside of like Terry. 1.8 gigatons of TNT, about a thousand times more powerful than the Zero Cannon that could destroy Southtown. But we're not done. One single jack unit was able to destroy a six mile yeah, wide. Hey, I actually got dog piled Earth. by them. Estimating its and they exploded. And density, the energy it would take to violently fragment it is nearly eight gigatons of TNT, over four times more powerful than Versus Hurricane. And Heihachi can tear through jacks like nothing, which is crazy because that satellite laser it reacted to was moving at about 4% the speed of light, twice as fast as the Zero Cannon and Geese's best. Geese was a clever, ruthless opponent, but Heihachi's power, experience, and sheer Yeah, that experience and durability put Heihachi over the edge. This fight was so intense, it almost made Mishima pants. What? Come on, bro. Shout out Heiachi, man. Thanks for watching. I wish Kuma, we'll Kuma would have came in to celebrate. What's the, right now, what's the next one? What's the next one? What's the next one? Let me see. Linked in the description. Next time. Who is that? Oh! Mikasa? Versus, uh... I want to say her name is Black from, uh... What's, what's it called? Um... Ruby? Blake. Blake versus Mikasa. Wow. And that's May 2nd. You know, I, I love Mikasa. The Ackermans, the Ackermans are just something different, man. Um, I'm not super versed on Blake. I know some of their characters go, like, have, like, some wild powers, but I'm, ro I'm rooting for Mikasa. I'm rooting for Mikasa, so, um... Yeah, anyway, guys, if you enjoy it, like, comment, subscribe. Be sure to share with your friends. See who they thought was going to win out of these two. Um, if you have any reaction requests, hit me up on my socials or leave a comment below telling me what you want me to check out. Um, anyway, guys, I'll see y'all back May 2nd for this this washing that Mikasa dishes out. I, I don't know if it would be a wash. Like like I said, the Ruby characters are pretty powerful. But anyway, guys, that's it for me. Uh, if you want to see the prelims, check the description for, for the link to the video so y'all can watch those. Uh, but anyway, guys, I'm going to get up out of here. Peace.